Hi and welcome back to this channel and thank you so much for clicking into this video. So in this video, I am going to teach you how to edit a .dat file. Make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you don't miss any important step or information. And without further ado, let's get on it. So the, or in this video, I'm going to show you or the process that I am going to teach you to edit a .dat file is by using a text editor. So if you want to know how you can do that, just continue watching this video. So the first step that you'll need to do is to right click onto your .dat file and select open with. So if your mouse doesn't have a right mouse button, just hold the control key as you click. So this method would only work if your .dat file contains plain text. And then for the next step, you just simply select the notepad if you're using Windows or text edit for Mac. And this opens the file for editing in your text editor. And after that, just review and edit the file. So if the file contains plain text, you'll usually be able to tell which application was used to make it. So sometimes even it is filled with unreadable characters, a that file will include some text that provides clues as to what type of file it is. So if you see an, an application name in the dot file, you may be able to use that application to open the file. So close the notepad or text edit without making changes and then just right click the dot file again and select open with and choose the application that you saw. And if you see something about video in that file, you may be able to open the dot file with a video player like VLC media player. And if you use notepad or text edit to edit a dot file with unreadable characters and then save it it will break the dot file making it unusable even if you open it in the correct program and for the last step what you need to do is to save your changes so if you edit the dot file in your text editor you can save your changes by simply clicking the file menu and selecting the save button and so that's it for this video. That's how you can edit that file. So I hope this helped you. And if it did, please make sure to like, subscribe, and hit notification bell button so you don't miss a video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.